say uh, that you're using your creativity and your artistic gifting to be a voice on behalf of another person. What does that mean to you? Okay. Um, one thing. One of my favorite verses that's in the Bible. It says that we should speak up for for those who have no voice. And I think uh, that's a very important thing to do. Is to be able to think of people that. How, don't have much of a platform to speak from and uh, to when you can to actually say something for them to help their plight and uh, not to think about yourself so much but to think about well, how, you know, how can I use the platform that I've got to actually speak about some, someone else and so I think that's what I like about this uh, artist hope thing There's, is, I, you don't have to push it down everyone's throats all the time and it's a very natural thing but you can actually just speak out for other people and people actually accept what you say because because they, th they know that you're actually uh, caring about someone else and not just yourself. And people want to help, I think, and they're, they're interested in hearing about the plight of people who are finding life really tough. So, so that's. And you're engaged with the cause personally. It's not just something that's yeah. out there. It's something you're you feel passionate about, <clears throat> connected to. Yeah, I think that's that's what's that's very important that uh, like with this. Thing that I've got involved with with the children in uh, Malawi. It's uh, like it's, I get little emails from the from the school, and uh, they tell me that they're thinking of me and that they're saying prayers for me, and they're hoping that I'll be able to raise the money to help them. And it really touches me. To, uh, it makes me think, wow, this is really important for them. You know, it's, it's very good. Awesome. Thank you.